Hi everybody, I'm Daryl McGraw, Vice President for Information Technology here at Wake Tech. A couple of years ago, we made the decision to become a Lenovo shop. What I mean by that is that we would take advantage of the, the lower state contract pricing, the higher reliability, and the close support that come with every Lenovo computer. Shortly after the college made that decision, however, we, uh, we, we had a budget crunch. We had some equipment shortfalls uh, in, our, in our budget and could not, uh, could not purchase as much equipment as we needed. So what started out as a three to five year uh, life cycle for computers became a five to nine year life cycle for computers. We even recently sent a, a truckload of older IBM computers to surplus that we had for a decade. Um, e even though we had serious, uh, serious budget issues, the purchase of Lenovo computers has skyrocketed. Here are some stats. As of today, we have a total of 3,291 student computers spread out in 188 locations in areas with as few as three and as many as 54 computers. In the past couple of years, almost all of the computer labs refreshed have been purchased from Lenovo. In student computers alone, we now have 686 computers in 36 labs. Lenovo Student Labs now account for about 20% or one in every five computers. Tomorrow, that percentage goes up as we replace two more computer labs on our Western Wake campus with Lenovo equipment. For faculty and staff, most new computers purchased are Lenovo computers. We have over 1,100 full-time employees and provide each with at least one computer. Many have a desktop and a laptop. These two are slowly but surely being replaced by Lenovo computers. We honor our commitment to students by providing them the most reliable, least expensive computers possible. After a thorough analysis of the vendors available on a statewide contract, we chose Lenovo. Let me take you on a brief tour of some of our facilities to demonstrate how we use Lenovo equipment in the instructional process. And now let's go into the tech room. This is where we stage, image, and prepare Lenovo computers for distribution to computer labs and to faculty offices on all of our campuses. Word of warning though, it's a little bit messy, and the mess is a byproduct of a lot of talented people working very hard. So what you see on your right here is a bunch of Lenovo computers that are now being imaged in preparation for distribution to a computer lab tomorrow. Tomorrow we're replacing two older Dell labs with these new Think Centers uh, at our Western Wake campus. And as we, uh, as we go forward and we purchase new computers, most of what is being replaced on, on campus uh, will consist of machines like these or the all-in-ones. The all-in-one machines have really been a big hit all over the campus. This is a typical classroom here at Wake Tech. Tables for, and chairs for students, an instructor podium, maps, whiteboard, things like that. But another thing that makes it typical here at Wake Tech is the use of instructional technology. We have projectors in every classroom uh, with the screens and the instructor podiums and, and things of that nature. When I first started college, we didn't have things like this, but now, based on uh, the use of this technology, we're able to reach more and more students. And, uh, and, and present information to them in a way that they can learn it quickly and reliably and, and efficiently. And uh, as w one other thing that I guess I should point out is the fact that this room, you can't see it, but it's all 100% wireless. All of our classrooms are, are wireless. And when students ask what type of computer they should, they should bring to campus, you know, we give them a certain set of specs and then they ask for recommendations. Uh, we recommend Lenovo for their reliability. Here we are in the Individualized Learning Center here at Wake Tech. I'm proud of the fact that Wake Tech does a, a, a great job of helping students outside the classroom with tutoring and, and extra help for, for math and science and th foreign languages, things of that nature. An another thing that we use uh, Lenovo computers for is this process right here. We have aud audit requirements that require us to, to be able to, uh, to track people coming in and out of the center. And we use this M90Z touchscreen to be able to uh, track students as they come in. They come in, they take their card off, they swipe their card, then they touch the class that they're here to study for, and, uh, and they're, they're clocked in. It's a great use of the technology. This is one of the computer labs at Wake Tech. This particular lab is in the library and uh, contains 30 computers. Uh, we really like the uh, Lenovo all-in-one computers for the simplicity and setup and the simplicity in wiring. They're very easy to maintain and they're, they're basically bulletproof, very highly reliable and they're very uh, cost effective as well. So here we are at the Wake Tech Data Center. 
We use a mixture of different servers, IBM mostly, some Dell, some HP, uh, a lot of different storage vendors, to be able to provide 24 hours a day, seven day a week operations for our distance learning students and our, our, our seated students. There's one thing I'd like to show you here inside the data center. So we have some space in our racks that are specifically set aside for the new line of Lenovo servers coming out. We're very, very excited to be able to uh, test out and try some of the Lenovo servers and we look forward to that product line being introduced and we, we hope we're one of your uh, first customers for, the, for that equipment. So as you can see, we're now heading towards being a Lenovo college. We appreciate the high reliability, competitively priced hardware that's available on our state contract. And we appreciate it so much that even in the face of budget shortfalls, we have replaced a full 20% of all of our student employee and computers, even with our limited funds. As time goes on and the budget improves even more, we'll continue to replace older labs with Lenovo equipment to continue to enjoy the cost savings and the labor savings that are associated with these products.